doing right now? Uh, we're practicing some bracing exercises. So when we think about being able to um, have solid movement in, um, without having a lot of energy leaks, as we like to call it. This core, all of this right here, has to be very strong. And the one way to kind of get that strength is by bracing exercises. When you think about squatting, deadlifting, lunging, you're holding something so you have to brace. You can't deadlift a lot of weight if you can't brace for it. And so practicing different bracing exercises and also helps seal up the body so that you don't have a lot of we call it like energy leaks um, through movement that can lead you to get hurt. So, you know, having a strong core is far, far more than being able to do 100 sit-ups in a minute. Um, I recently had a client come in. She's new. She can't really brace very well. And it made me learn not to take this for granted because what he's doing right now, he's doing it right now in five-second intervals because that's just the workout. She has to do them in three-second intervals because she's not strong there. And because she's not strong there, all the other exercises that we want to do, we have to tone them all down until she's able to brace like this.